Hi students. Okay, today we are learning the topic is multiple integrals. So multiple integrals means a double integral, triple integral, up to so on. So double integral means a integration of a two variable function that is called a double integral. Similarly, integration of three variable function that is called triple integrals. So first of all, we will discussing. See the definition. A double integral or triple integral is known as multiple integral. Is an extension of definite integral of a function of single variable to a function of two or three variables. That is a two variable function. Integration is called double integral. Three variable function of integration is triple integral. Triple integration. This is called multiple integrals. So, what is using of multiple integrals? Uh, using this one to find area, volume, mass, centroid in a plane and solid region. This is one of the application of multiple integrals. Okay, na. Okay, next to first of all, we were discussing the topic is double integrals. Okay, see the definition of double integrals. Let f of x comma y be a function defined at all points of a region or in the x y plane bounded by one or more curves. Then the double integral of f of x comma y over the region is denoted by integration over r f of x comma y dx dy or integration over r f of x comma y dr and that is a given function is defined the given two variable function f of x comma y is defined in the region r and x comma y is the point is belongs to in the r now finding the limits of x and y in the r so therefore the double integration is denoted by so integration over r f of x comma y dx dy so this is called double integral so next one double integral over rectangular region so rectangular region so what is the limits in the region of to finding the double integral see that let f of x comma y be a function defined on rectangular region or so our reason is equal to here x comma y such that a less than or equal to x less than or equal to b c less than or equal to y less than or equal to d and that means x limits a to b y limits c to d and x limits constants y limit constant and both limits of x and y are must be constants so that is region is called a rectangular region therefore the double integration over r uh, we can define so simple form r is equal to a comma b comma c comma d and a b is the x limits c comma d is the y limits therefore integration can be right integration over r f of x comma y into dx dy is equal to so integration x is equal to zero to b integration y is equal to c to d of f of x comma y into dy dx or integration y is equal to c to d integration x is equal to a to b f of x comma y dx dy and that means the given integration first with respect to x or y both are same and you can do first integral with respect to x or y because x limits constant y limits constants so we can do integrating first of all with respect to x or y we getting the same answer that is only over the rectangular region so first integrate with respect to x y constant okay, okay na that is first x uh, eliminating x substituting limits then finding the integration with respect to y substituting y limits so otherwise first integrating with respect to y x constant and y eliminating next with respect to x substituting x limits so 
total values must be in the number overall the value of the double integral or triple integral must be a number so this is double integral over rectangular region so next definition iterated integrals an integral expression of the form integration x is equal to a to b integration y is equal to y1 of x2 y2 of x f of x comma y into dy dx that means the first integrating first integrating with respect to y y limits are functions of x and the second integrating with respect to x so x limits must be constant and if first integrating the limits are functions second integrating limits are constant that is called iterated integrals or sometimes the integration we can define uh, integrating y is equal to c to d integrating x is equal to x1 of y2 x2 of y f of x comma y into dx dy and here in this integral the integrating with respect to x first of all so x limits are functions of y then the second time integrating with respect to y that is y limits are constants so this type of integral is called iterated integrals both are double integrals so anyone first with respect to y x constant y limits are functions then x with respect to second time x or first integrate with respect x x limits are functions the second integrate with respect to y y limits are constant so this type of called iterated integrals okay next one so next double integral over non rectangular region that is a general region so what are the limits in the non rectangular region then how to finding the double integral see that here so let f of x comma y be a function defined over non rectangular region or can be described by two two types of region as so non rectangular region defining two types and okay na so that is equal to integ uh, r is equal to x comma y such that a less than or equal to x less than or equal to b y1 of x less than or equal to y less than or equal to y2 of x and that means one variable having the limits are functions the second variable limits are constants so your y limits functions of x so x limits are constant then the integration can be right integration over r f of x comma y dx dy is equal to so integrating x is equal to a to b integration y is equal to y1 x2 y2 of x f of x comma y into dy dx and that means this type of is called iterate integral okay now similarly second type or is equal to x comma y x1 of y less than or equal to x less than or equal to x2 of y c less than or equal to y less than or equal to d that means here x limits are functions of y y limits are constant this is a second type of non rectangular region then the double integral can be right integration over r f of x comma y dx dy that is equal to integration y is equal to c to d integration x is equal to x1 of y2 x2 of y f of x comma y into dx dy and a non rectangle region low one variable limits are functions second variable limits are constants so this is called a double integral over non rectangular region see that one of the note uh, if not given limits to evaluate the integration draw a vertical or horizontal strip in the region whichever makes the integration easier easier 
so that means uh, if the limits are given directly we can directly finding the integration okay that is any 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 limits one variable constants uh, one variable limits are constants one variable functions or both limits are constant that is a given directly we can directly finding the integration if not given directly in limits of the given integration then how to finding the integration so first of all finding the limits how to finding the limits in the given region now choosing a vertical strip or a horizontal strip so what is the work of vertical and horizontal strip so why taking vertical or horizontal see that here for vertical strip the vertical strip starts from the lowest part of the region and terminate on the highest part of the region that means x limits are constants take from left to right strip moves and y limits are functions of x take from bottom to up and that means the work of vertical strip in the region which is uh, which is moves in the given region from left to right and along x axis so this vertical strip covering the entire the region and this is this uh, strip is slide along y axis sorry x axis so there is x limits must to be constants y limits are functions of x this is the work of vertical strip so now finding the limits directly in case otherwise we have to choosing the horizontal strip the horizontal strip starts from the left to part of the region and terminate on the right part of the region that is y limits are constants take from bottom to up strip moves and x limits are functions of y take from left to right and that means the horizontal strip is also same cover the entire the region which is uh, which moves from along y axis and the y limits are constants and the down to of and x limits are functions of y that is the left to right so this is a vertical strip and horizontal strip then after finding the limits then also find integration of the given so next to area how to finding area so area to finding the area by using the double integral so let the area includes by two curves y is equal to f1 of x y is equal to f2 of x and x is equal to a x is equal to b in the xy plane and the area is lies between two curves y is equal to f1 of x to y is equal to f2 of x between x is equal to a and x is equal to b then the area is can be write in the formula so area is equal to integration x is equal to a to b integration y is equal to f1 of x to f2 of x dy dx and the function is one in the region so this is called area of the between two curves so that is equal to see that graph so this is the area and this is the area between x is equal to a to b from y is equal to f1 of x to f2 of x okay na so this is the definition of double integral and the procedure to find evaluation of double integrals for more videos please do subscribe my channel like and share it thank you